there welcome back and welcome to my channel if you are new today I'm gonna be sharing my 20 week pregnancy update and yes I am sitting on the floor in my room but that's just where this is where I like to film my videos <laughs> um, my name is Kaylee if you are new so I wanted to share my 20 week update real quick I have some a little piece of paper of notes right here so I can stay like on track and not be forgetful um, I just wrote out a few notes over this week and I need to wash my hair tonight um, I put in some dry shampoo but me filming this video happened to land on a day that I needed to wash my hair so sorry um, but yeah so this week I am 20 weeks pregnant today I am wait, 20 weeks and three days along um, I had my 20 week scan on Tuesday which was I had my scan I think on February 9th and everything went well so I wanted to like talk about that a little bit to start off this video um, I also have some pictures so I will take pictures of uh, like a few ultrasound pictures and show that too um, but I think during the ultrasound she was sleeping because the ultrasound technician was trying to get her to move she had the like the little ultrasound tool and she was like shaking my stomach not aggressively but she was like wake up baby wake up baby because you know how they have to get all sorts of different pictures of their body and she was like trying to get her to like rotate or something I think that that happened to be like her nap time or something because she was sleeping and then we also got this picture of her and she had her her shin like up to her face like so actually it was like her foot because you know their feet their legs the ratio proportion of a baby versus like an adult is different so like her foot was like right here so we got that picture and at one point in the ultrasound she put her hands like on her head like this yeah and then the ultrasound technician wanted me to jump up and down to get her to like rotate yeah so that was that and then my doctor looked over the ultrasound and said that everything looks good and normal and I'm still praying of course for a healthy baby healthy pregnancy and a healthy labor and delivery without any complications in that the Lord will just be with us and protect us and as you can tell when I talk a lot I'm like out of breath <laughs> so I guess that's another symptom um, another thing I'm experiencing is pregnancy brain I really think that is such a real thing I'm so forgetful it's not really like me to be all that forgetful yeah so I just have pregnancy brain Oh, also I forgot to mention with the ultrasound when I was getting like the results back um, they said that my placenta is posterior which means it's behind the baby which is normal of course um, but I've always had like anterior placentas so it's kind of like cool to be able to like know that to know that I have a posterior placenta and also that I have been feeling kicks um, if I'm like laying down I will feel little kicks and it's just nice to be able to feel kicks to know that she's okay another thing that I will be ex that I do experience sometimes if if I am overworking myself usually when I'm not pregnant I can do quite a few tasks in the day but now that I'm getting bigger and I'm growing and like my ligaments my muscles supporting my belly are growing and being worked more I have to remember to slow down or else I will get like an achy feeling in my lower abdomen not like cramps or contractions just like an achiness and I also will sometimes get like a, a sciatic nerve pain like ever so slightly like it's just now coming on which it's early like compared to my boys I didn't really experience that till way later but I do not experience that pain if like I'm not doing too much if that makes sense so if I do too much then I might get like a sharp pain in my lower back where that nerve is but I have a feeling when I'm getting bigger as time goes on I will be experiencing the sciatic nerve pain um, a lot more that's how it was for my second pregnancy especially towards the end um, having to remember to like rest lay down every so often is really important to remember moving on from that <laughs> um, another thing that I have been noticing is the desire to start nesting to start organizing which I have been doing and I have been um, organizing like 
the boys room going I've taken two bins of boy clothes over to store at my mom's house I have been really wanting to declutter um, items and just get rid of stuff declutter organize and even um, I'm sort of thinking about getting a new homeschool table for downstairs just because the one that we currently are using is small for my two boys um, it kind of works but like the width of it isn't wide enough for them to hold to have paper like like the papers will like touch and it might I don't know if I'm making sense but the table is a little too small but it works for now I mean maybe in the future we'll get we'll be on the hunt for a table but this is that's just something that I've been thinking about and every once in a while I'll remember like oh I want to go through that box or I want to declutter and go through this drawer so another thing that I notice is I have been the neighbor's dog keeps barking <laughs> But I have been irritable and moody. When I was pregnant with Jameson, I didn't really get that irritable. But I don't know if that's like the difference between a, like me being pregnant with a girl this time, how I get moody and irritable. Um, another thing I've been experiencing is when I'm pregnant, the hairs on my stomach get darker. And I don't know if they get thicker, but they definitely get darker. So it makes it look like I'm like more hairy there. But... I mean, really only I notice it. They do, my hair is darker, but then when, when I deliver and everything, and a little bit after postpartum, like, my hairs go back to normal. It's really weird. It's the weirdest thing ever. But yeah, my hairs get darker on my stomach. And also, I notice my hair gets thicker. Like, I start to get kind of like, almost like a sideburn right here. I get like baby hairs up here a little bit. But postpartum, I will lose a lot of hair. I guess two more things I have on here and my battery's flashing at me <laughs> so another thing I've been experiencing is I've been a lot more sweaty like in my armpits which is kind of annoying um, which I've noticed today which I mean it's fine um, is what it is so that's another weird symptom another thing is I have been wanting it to be warmer I'm tired of wearing like jackets I want it to be warm so that's like a random one right there, but it's true. So yeah, this concludes the pregnancy update. I'll show you guys my bump shot real quick. I have my tank top tucked in to my pants, but this is about it for 20 weeks. With go in the front. I feel like you can really tell when I go to the side. That is it for this 20 week update. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you guys have a blessed day in Jesus' name. Okay. Bye.